Hey everyone, welcome back to Code of the Row. In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to import fonts into Unreal Engine. So let's get started. So now I'm going to go to Google Fonts and search for a font. And in this case, I'm just going to use this Bebus Nui font, um, just because it's kind of easy to distinguish from the other fonts that are currently in Unreal Engine. And then I'll click Get Font and Download. I'm just going to extract this to my desktop. And now you'll see that once it's extracted, I have this TTF file type and that's it. So I'm just going to double click to open it and click install. And once that's done, I'm going to want to move this to my Unreal Engine folder. Back in my Unreal Engine project, I'm going to click import and I'm going to go to that font and select this TTF file and click open. And I'll create a new font asset using the imported font as its default font. So I'll hit yes. And now you're going to see that it created this font. And if I just want to test it out, I would just open my HUD. So in this case, I'm just going to go over to my HUD. And now once I'm in my HUD, I am just going to test it out by just, I'll just add a text into my canvas panel and I'll just drag this in the middle. And then under, I'm just going to change the text box to this is the font I downloaded. And now under appearance, I'm going to go to my font tab and change this font family from Roboto to the Bebus Nui, just like this. And if I hit compile and play, it will just be in the middle of the screen like this. And it's not gonna look good just cause it's just a simple text in the middle of my screen, but it's a good example. And I can make it bigger just to make it more readable by just going back to my HUD, clicking on this text and under appearance, I will just increase. And now when I hit play, and now when I hit play, you'll see that it's just showing the font that I downloaded. And that's pretty much it. Thanks for watching Code of the Road. Like, subscribe, comment below what you want to see next, and I'll see you in the next video.